Well, there's a local tie to the Boston race. Prince George's County Executive Rashern Baker is running this year's race and running with him. Corporal Tony Grimes and Sergeant Terrence Nelson. And Rashern Baker joins us live on the phone this morning. Good morning to you. Happy race day. How you feeling? <laughs> Audrey, thank you. Uh, I'm feeling good. It, it's rainy up here, though, so we're expecting rain throughout it. So uh, I wish the weather was a lot better. Oh, yeah, it's kind of like you're rainy, running in D.C. today. We're seeing the same thing. We're taking a live look at the um, starting line this morning, where you will be shortly. Uh, this is your first marathon, correct? It, it is. It is. So I'm very nervous, and uh, um, but, but excited at the same time. But this is the first time, so this is, this is going to be interesting. <laughs> Can you talk about how you got into running? Well, you know, I really got into it because when I took over um, as county executive, you know, it, it was a lot of stress. Um, and I had picked up so much weight and thinking about um, the office and, and the former county executive, Wayne Curry, said I needed to start doing something or else, you know, I wouldn't survive the administration. And I got to running with the cadets. And um, I, that's really where it started. I could only run a mile when we first started with them. And I worked my way up to 10 and then uh, to where we are today, but it was really, um, and it was about being healthier, and I think that's what we wanted in the county, to relieve stress, um, to get healthier, and, um, and and it's worked for me. Oh, it's such a good outlet, such a good outlet, and we've got photos here of you uh, training with Corporal Tony Grimes and Sergeant Terrence Nelson from the Prince George's County Police Department. Now, are they longtime runners, or did they just pick it up as well? No, they actually were uh, longtime runners. They were with the uh, training academy that uh, uh, that trained our cadets and our and our troops, and uh, and they're the ones who really made sure I stuck to the schedule, even in the early years when I was just doing one mile. Um, I think the message is, I would say for folks, one, this is we want to be healthier um, as a as a county and a, and as a state, um, but also for stress. People are under a lot of stress, whether it's work or family. And for caregivers, I would say to them that this is really a good outlet also. That's true. Well, you guys look great running, and we are wishing you all the best. Before I let you go, really quickly, do you have any kind of uh, superstitions that you follow on race day? Are you eating bananas? What's the, what are you doing? I, I do. I have a pair of shoes that I've run to practice uh, to when, when we did 21, 21 miles and 23 miles. So I've got that, and I've got my favorite uh, you know, uh, jacket on. So I have the Prince George's County jacket to get me through. Awesome. All right. Well, I hope that you can feel the support all the way from back here at home. We wish you, Tony Grimes, and Terrence Nelson the very best. Good luck today. Thank you very much.